Late night in the Hollywood Hills, starlight and social life thrills, heart stopping thrill, looks that could kill, red lips, a lit cigarette, black dress, smoky silhouette, collecting our bags. Lovers roulette Round and round and round she goes Where she stops Nobody knows Vanishes like a ghost Late night, Sunset Boulevard Headlights of luxury cars Wherever you are, she's never too far Currently 7:20 a.m. and it's not the weekend. It's Wednesday actually, which some of you might be wondering, like, bro, I thought you you get up at 6 a.m. and I do, I do, I do. But on Wednesdays I've gotten back into Muay Thai now with uh, my friend Paul, and training starts at 8:30. It's only 10 minutes away from here, and on these days I allow myself just a little bit more rest because I know I'm about to kind of just get beaten up, so kind of just take a little moment in the morning and just I don't know that's my little excuse I'm lazy on Wednesdays that's kind of what it is so over the past few months now I've developed a new kind of like morning habit and that's with using AG1 who are the sponsors of today's video so I drink AG1 each morning first thing and like I said it's pretty much become my morning routine slash habit for those of you that might not be aware of AG1 it's comprehensive daily nutrition made simple. It's made up of 75 high quality whole food sourced ingredients, which include vitamins, minerals, superfoods, probiotics, and more. So I've noticed two major things since I started drinking AG1. One is the sustained energy I have throughout the day. I used to always dip around like two, two, three p.m. I would just come down and want to take a nap, but now I just have consistent energy throughout the day. And second is the clarity slash focus I have when performing tasks. I just find myself just not getting as distracted as easily. So as I mentioned, oh, almost dropped it. As I mentioned, this has become part of my morning ritual. So it's great that when I do go away and travel, I can stay on top of my health because AG1 also offer the travel packs as well. And to be honest, when I'm traveling is the time that I need this most. So they recommend you having eight to 12 ounces. I personally like going on the 12 ounce side just because it's a great way to also get hydrated and I enjoy the taste. And then it's as simple as just literally one scoop from here. And I'll tell you what I love, is the fact that the scoop goes in. From there, all you gotta do, make sure the lid's on nice and tight. Shake it up for a little bit. All mixed up, good to go. If I had to describe the taste to you, and if you've watched me describe colognes, I suck at this. It's smooth, smooth is the thing I'm gonna start off first. It's like smooth and creamy, but like in a good way, and then like, I don't know, it's like a subtle sweetness. It's just, it's not overwhelming. It's just easy to drink, especially first thing in the morning. So you can try it out yourself, team. There is a link in the description box down below. And with your first purchase, you will get one year free supply of vitamin D3, K2, and five travel packs. It's that easy.
Crab cross, lean back cross. Then you can go knee, long hand, there you go. Good, push those hips forward. I haven't been too happy with my media setup for a while. I love the shelf, this is the zigzag shelf, but I don't believe I had all the right pieces on it. So I'm gonna switch it up very slightly and see if it's an improvement. So that's how we're kind of looking. To be honest, it probably looks the same to most of you, but I swear to God it is different. I'll try to put up a before and after as well. All I've done is just currently use things that I already own. But if any of you have any other suggestions of what I could do here to just make certain areas pop a little bit, do let me know. One thing I do love, which is a very simple thing, was moving the flowers from there to there. It balances it up very well with my dining table. And yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm a lot happier with this. To me, this makes a lot more sense than before. Patiently waiting on my dreams to come true. Hoping and praying one day that they do. Oh, I don't know how and I don't know when. Just patiently waiting till then. Patiently waiting each day that goes by Staring out windows at stars in the sky Imagining one day I'll be one of them But patiently waiting till then Maybe I've lost my mind Maybe this whole thing is a joke And no one let me know Is it even warm?
ever since I went to the watch house, which was the coffee shop in alone in London, well, I haven't been able to kind of like stop thinking about these coffee mugs. I know how that sounds, but these are actually the coffee mugs that they use. And I just really like them. I thought they were the perfect size. They're by a company called Mono, Mono Wear. I'll put a link in the description box and I thought they'd be a great replacement for these ones. I got these a while back now and I haven't really been enjoying them for a while and I thought these would be great in the office and then it kind of just gives me an excuse as well to pick up a few new ones which just help add to the space. So I was finally able to pick up the Marcelo shirts and shorts. Actually when I say pick up I mean like have my own set because the set that I get is purely the sample ones and these have just come back from the e-com shoot so now they're officially mine and I actually get to wear them and then they're the full production sample. So I'm going to chuck these on and show you kind of like the full finished product. So I'm chucking it on with some white linen trousers just to showcase it better and also this is how I like to style them anyway. So if you've been keeping up with the brand, you'll know that originally with this shirt I wanted to have hidden buttons so you wouldn't be able to see the buttons at all and ultimately we decided against it because oh, <laughs> it looks so good oh, I love that um what was I saying hidden buttons yeah so ultimately I decided against it because it just it didn't flow well with how light this material is. This is 100% virgin wool. It just wasn't doing the effect that I wanted. And on top of that, because we weren't using all that excess material to hide the buttons, we were able to bring the whole overall cost down because again, we weren't using as much material. In future shirts, I would like to implement that hidden button because I do really like how clean it works, but it's not for this silhouette. And that is how that bad boy looks. So this is dropping, well, on the 21st, which when this goes up, so this will be live now. It's dropping this beautiful khaki and I'll put on the black one now for you. It is so comfortable on the skin, so flowy, so nice, and so just, I, I, it's, it's hard because I don't want to gas up my own stuff because I am aware of how it sounds but all I can say is that I never thought that I'd get to this point in my life where I'm creating pieces like these that I just believe it. It's, it's just, it's crazy. It's crazy what's kind of like, I'm able, ah, uh, I can't even speak on this properly. It's just like, it's quite awesome to see a piece come to life and to come to life in a way that was beyond what kind of you imagined. And I get it, it's just a shirt. So these are the Marcelo shorts, again, in that nice relaxed design. They mean to come just above the knees, which I think is that perfect length. And they're just again, so flowy, so nice with that elasticated waistband right here. And then the off-white cream drawstrings, which I love featuring two pockets here and then one back pocket on the right cheek. Now what I do want to note about this material, it is very delicate, it is very light. So we've pocket tested these. You can have your phone in here, you can have your wallet in here. It is fine. But if you're putting sharp keys and stuffing that in here, we just don't suggest it because it's not going to take much for you know your keys being sharp to just get in and kind of rip it. So that is what the khaki pair look like. And that is the black pair there as well. Same drawstring. I wear a medium in everything from the shirt to the shorts. But yeah team, this is the Marcelo and it is available now. So I'll put a link in the description box and you know, go check it out. Thank you.